She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her guys, it's Jasmine here and for today's video we have another haul and for this haul I have another Romway haul for you guys. You guys know the drill, I have so many things to show you guys. I got a lot of cute fall items and winter items to show you guys. Everything is so cute and I'll link everything down below. If you guys want anything, if you guys want to order anything, definitely use my discount code. I put it in the corner, one of these corners. I think I put the discount code in this corner. But yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling now and get started with the haul because I have a lot of items to show you guys. So for the first thing I have to show you guys in this haul is a super cute Argyle sweater. If you guys know me and you guys have been watching my hauls for the past few months, you guys know I love Argyle and I especially love Argyle sweaters. Another thing you guys might know about me is that I love brown recently. The color brown for the fall season I've been obsessed with. So this is like a mixture of my two favorite things. This is so cute. I feel like it's gonna be so cute to wear during the fall season I could wear this with like a cute little skater skirt or something I love the colors of this it's really neutral I think it's a great fall wardrobe piece I'm really excited to style this and you guys are definitely gonna be seeing me wear this definitely follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you guys want to see some more outfits from me so the next two things I have in this haul are two hoodies if you guys know I love these hoodies from Romway these are so cute and really affordable these are not super cheap I feel like a lot of people expect Romway to be like super cheap but these are around $25 and I feel like for cropped hoodies these are really good quality I know they have other like styles that are cheaper but they're not as good quality to be honest so I feel like you guys should definitely invest in these ones I'll link them down below if you guys want them the first one that I got is this really cute like periwinkle lilac purple color I love it so much it's so cute I love the color of this and I feel like it's gonna be so cute even though it's more of like a summer color I'm still gonna wear it for the winter and fall season I'm obsessed with this color I love it so much I think it looks so nice and I'm definitely gonna be wearing this by the way I got these in a size small I tried out their extra small before and it's way too small on me so I sold that one I don't really like the extra small but yeah anyways I also got a black one really nice a basic black one I have a brandy mobile black hoodie but the brandy mobile one it's not my favorite material, so I really wanted to test out this one, and I really like it, so I'm definitely going to be wearing this. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really nice crop denim jacket. I really like testing out denim jackets from Romway, because I feel like before, they were really bad, honestly. I never got denim jackets from Romway, but recently, this past year, I've been really impressed with these. This is just a really nice light wash one. I feel like the quality is really good. This is something I could definitely find at, like, Urban Outfitters or American Eagle. The quality is actually really great, and I definitely recommend it. I'll link this one down below as well. So the next thing I got in this haul is kind of like a shirt but half zip. I really like this, but to be honest, it kind of looks crooked because the pocket doesn't align with the jacket. Um, that's not my favorite part, so I don't know if I'm going to keep it. I still think it's really cute, and it's a really comfy jacket, and I like the concept of it, but I don't know if you guys can see. You guys might see on the trial part, the pocket pattern just looks funny against, like, the jacket because they didn't align it correctly. But other than that, this jacket's really nice. I feel like it's going to be great for the fall season and winter season, and I definitely wear this if, like, it was even. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute oversized sweater. This is so cute. It's a really nice color block blue and white sweater. I feel like this style is super trendy right now, and to be honest, I love the fit of this. I got this in a size large, I'm pretty sure, and it fits really nicely. I feel like if you guys want the oversized fit, definitely get a size large. It's so nice. I love how it looks. I could probably wear this as a sweater dress if I wanted to as well. Also, this is really soft. Like, it's so soft. I could definitely wear this to sleep if I wanted to. I'm so excited to wear this, and this is probably one of the softest sweaters I've ever gotten from Romway. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute pair of baggy jeans. Normally, I get a lot of jeans in my haul, but to be honest, for this haul, I only got like three pairs of pants. Um, that's like not much, but to be honest, I get a lot more in my other hauls. Um, this is just a really cute pair of baggy jeans. Um, it's really nice color block. I've been seeing a lot of color block online, so I really wanted to test this one out for you guys. I love the fit of this. The fit of this is amazing. This is my favorite fit for like Bromway jeans. It fits so nicely. The quality is really good as well. To be honest, I think this has been sold out for a while. I don't know if it's still in stock, but if they do restock, definitely check it out. Okay, so the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute oversized flannel. I've been really obsessed with flannels for like the fall and winter season. I feel like Bromway has 
has a bunch of these like thick flannels that you could basically wear as jackets. Uh, I live in California so it doesn't get too cold here. If you live somewhere that snows, obviously you cannot wear these as jackets. But I live in California so I could definitely get away with wearing this as a jacket and I love it. I love the color of it. I feel like the quality of these are just so good. I used to thrift a lot of flannels and I feel like thrifting flannels is definitely a great option. But nowadays it's really hard to find like cute colors like this so I feel like this is a great option. Also, I think this is a dupe of like an Urban Outfitters flannel because I used to buy flannels from Urban Outfitters for like 50 to $70 and honestly, I do not know why I spent that much money on Urban Outfitters clothing. Urban Outfitters is so expensive and Romwe has so many cute affordable dupes. So the next thing I got in this haul is actually a pretty trendy piece. I've been seeing all over Pinterest, TikTok, everywhere on Instagram of girls wearing cute little furry bags. They normally wear like the tote ones and I ordered some of the tote ones to test out as well but I haven't gotten them yet. So I decided to get like a cute little shoulder bag. I feel like this is really cute for like the winter season. To be honest, this got trendy in the summer and I'm like, I'm not about to wear a fur bag in the summer. I'm gonna start sweating. But now it's the winter season and the fall season. So I feel like it's appropriate to wear these bags. They're so cute. I'm just gonna throw them on whenever I go out. Maybe when I go to the grocery store or out with my friends. This is such a cute piece. It's so soft. And I'm really excited to style this. This is really out of my comfort zone. But I feel like I'm probably gonna be getting more because I really like how it looks. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute two-piece sweater set. I've been really obsessed with this lately. I feel like sweater sets are so cute for the fall and winter season. These are so nice. This is just a really nice gray one. I got this in a size small and it fits really nicely. It's just a really nice bodycon little skirt. And then it comes with a really nice bodycon shirt. I don't know if that made sense. A really nice cropped shirt. It's really cute. It's knit. It's super cropped. It literally cuts off right under my boobie. So if you're more modest, I definitely don't suggest this, but if you don't care, I think this is a great outfit to wear for the fall season. Moving on, I have another denim piece. As I said earlier, I feel like Romwe has definitely been stepping up on their denim jackets. Before, I hated them. I got a denim jacket once from Romwe and I literally donated it. I did not like it. So I wanted to test out some more because recently, I've been seeing a lot of cute ones online. So I decided to order this one and I'm honestly so impressed. The quality of this denim is so nice. It's super Super thick it's really really heavy I feel like that's how I test out denim if it's heavy it's good denim the one I got like a few years ago from Romwe was so light it was so thin and this one's super thick definitely great for the fall season and winter season this honestly compares to like my Levi's denim jackets obviously Levi denim jackets are like out of this world I cannot compare it too much but this is good. definitely a great dupe if you guys want like the oversized like kind of like biker jacket fit but you guys don't want to pay like $150 on Levi's this is around $30 and I feel like it's amazing I love the wash of them it's a in between like a light to medium wash I really like it and I definitely recommend this I feel like I could definitely style this so many different ways so the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute fuzzy sweater these fuzzy sweaters I've been seeing all over Pinterest and I think they look so cute for the fall and winter season this one's a little bit big i got this in a size small and to be honest i honestly would have preferred an extra small it's really stretchy to be honest so i feel like it could fit up to a size large maybe of course a medium this is really nice it's purple with orange trim i like this colorway i don't wear colors that much but i've been trying to go like get more out of my comfort zone and wear cute sweaters like this so this is a really interesting piece that I'm really excited to style. I will say the quality is not my favorite, but it's honestly not bad for the price. I've seen these sweaters go for like $50 to $100 on other websites, and this one's around $20 to $25. So I don't mind it. It's really cute, and I definitely recommend it. If you guys can't afford the other ones, this is a great dupe. If you guys don't know, I'm from California, specifically close to San Francisco, and I go to San Francisco pretty often, and I always see these cute tours, like gift shops, and I always want to buy something from them, but they're always so expensive. So I never buy it and I saw on Romwe they had this really cute tourist like sweater. I'm not gonna lie, I think I saw this exact same thing when I went to Pier 39 last month and it was like $40 but this one is only like $20 so I feel like this is definitely a great deal. If you guys want some San Francisco merch, I know Romwe has a bunch. They also have a lot of Los Angeles merch as well. So you guys should definitely check it out. I think this is a great sweater and I'm so glad I didn't buy it at the gift shop because I would have spent way more money than I did on Romway. So the next thing I got in this haul is a pair of sweatpants. I just got a pair of grey basic sweatpants. Not much to say about it. I've been seeing this on the Romway site for a while and I've been trying to test out 
more different sweatpants because to be honest I only wear my Brandy Melville sweatpants and Brandy Melville sweatpants they're not that bad but if I could find a cheaper alternative on runway I'd definitely go for it this is not like the Brandy Melville one at all but that's not a bad thing I think this is a great pair of sweatpants this kind of reminds me of the sweatpants I steal from my boyfriend this just looks like manly sweatpants it's not like the cute little Brandy Melville sweatpants you know it's really nice I got a size small and it fits pretty big honestly I could have gone for a size extra small I was just scared it was gonna be too small but the small is pretty big on me so the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute oversized sweater this is just a really nice oversized brown sweater tannish sweater it's huge um, it's very slouchy um, to be honest out of my comfort zone but I really like the look of it I really like the style I think it's really cute and I definitely recommend it it's just this really nice like cable knit kind of sweater super cute it's really cute to wear it like jeans for the fall and winter season this kind of reminds me of that one meme going around on Twitter and TikTok the Christian fall girl meme I feel like this is definitely what a Christian fall girl in the south would wear I don't hate it I think it's cute and I probably would wear this so the next thing I got in this haul is a really really cool pair of like cargo jeans I don't really know if this even counts as cargo jeans um, these are very out of my comfort zone. I honestly was very worried about getting them and I thought they were gonna look really weird on me and to be honest, I don't hate it. I think it looks really cool. They're just this really cool pair of like dark wash denim jeans. They're kind of like a blue tint to them and they have white stitching all over it. But what makes it cool is that they have these cute little blue detailing. I don't know what this is. I don't hate it. To be honest, I wouldn't mind if it was gone. I really like the fit of these jeans. I think they're the perfect pair of baggy jeans. These just are just very out of my comfort zone I don't have anything like this but I'm really excited to wear it I think it looks really nice on really cool super edgy and I feel very like in style whenever I wear it and the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute blue argyle sweater I always get argyle sweaters from like Romway and Shein and stuff because I love testing them out they've been coming out with so many different styles I feel like they have so many different argyles and I love testing them out for you guys this is just another blue one this is very similar to the other ones that I got but they have these like weird like pocket looking details I thought they were pockets when I ordered it but tell me why it's just a little string. I feel like that's kind of dumb, to be honest. I'd rather have it be pockets. But yeah, honestly, I might just cut this off because I think it looks funny. It, look, it doesn't look correct to me. I feel like if it had function to it and I could actually use it as a pocket, I wouldn't mind it. The fact that it's just string just bothers me, so... I don't know if this is my favorite. I think this is useless. Like, this is weird. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute varsity style jacket. It's just a really nice black one. Um, to be honest, I this is not my favorite. I really like the look of it and the fit of it is really nice. But um, it's really cheap. It like feels like not the best material. I have other varsity jackets that I got from other sites that I like better. And this one just is not up to par. I feel like I can't complain because it was really cheap. Like it was like $20 and I feel like it's worth $20. But I just expect a lot from Romway because the quality of their clothing is actually really good. And this one is not my favorite. So that's all I gotta say. I think it's cute. If you guys can't afford the other one, this is a great option. It fits really nicely, but the material is not my favorite. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute two-piece set. It's a really nice kind of fallish two-piece set. I got a lot of these two-piece sets for the summer season, but I feel like this is like a fall version of it. It's just this really nice red and orange warm tone skirt. It has button detailing, super cute. I got this in a size extra small, I'm pretty sure, and it fits really nicely. And then it comes with a really nice kind of like cropped button-up shirt, flannel thin flannel but it's really cute definitely recommend I like how it looks it's just a really nice plaid-ish flannel really cute together you can wear it together or separately really great versatile pieces okay, so the next thing I got in this haul is another Sherpa jacket I think this is really cute but to be honest I have no like purpose for these like little strings to be honest um I might just cut them off I think they look funky other than that I feel like this is a great jacket for the fall and winter season it's just a staple jacket really cute cream color zip up cross really nice pretty thick will definitely keep me warm and I definitely recommend this I will just cut this part off to be honest so the next thing I got in this haul is another oversized denim jacket this is not like the denim jacket I showed you guys earlier to be honest this is a bit thinner material but it's a different kind of like style denim jacket it's just a really nice dark wash with stripes on it this is also very out of my comfort zone. I don't know if I'm going to be wearing it. I think it looks really cute. And I always see girls on like Pinterest and stuff styling this. 
so I'm gonna try to style it myself. I got size large, so it was like an oversized fit, and to be honest, it fits really cool. I like the fit of it. It is a bit thinner than the jacket I showed you guys earlier, but it's still a great denim jacket. The material is really nice. It's not itchy at all, and I definitely will be wearing this as well. Okay, so the next thing I got in this haul is another cute little cable knit sweater. This one's just a really nice basic, kind of like white one. I have this cable knit sweater. I feel like this is a dupe of a brandy sweater. To be honest, this is not very similar to the Brandy Melville one. I have the Brandy Melville one and the Brandy Melville one is a bit more cropped and it's a bit thicker. Um, this one's really cute as well but I'm honestly probably gonna sell it because I already have the Brandy Melville one and I prefer the Brandy Melville one over this one. So the next thing I got in this haul is a really cute kind of like half zip sweater, kind of quarter zip. This is very oversized. This kind of looks like something like my grandpa or uncle would wear. This is really cute, really nice tan color, super super thick. I was not expecting it to be this thick. This is so heavy. It's a really nice silver metal detailing. I think this is really cute as well. I definitely recommend this for the fall season. You could just throw this on with like some cute little jeans or something. So the next thing I got in this haul, I honestly do not know why I got it. It's very weird and I keep on thinking about why I got it. But then recently I thought of like a cute Halloween costume I could wear with it. It's just this really nice denim jacket and it has metal detailing all over it. Tell me why but I feel like this will be a really cute like Base cowgirl costume for Halloween. It has metal detailing all over it. It has stars. Super cute. It's cropped. Really nice. I like the quality of this one a lot. This one's pretty pricey. This was around $30. But I feel like that's not bad because I feel like stuff with like embellishments always cost more money. I'm really excited to wear this. Hopefully I'm a space cowgirl for Halloween and I could wear this. I think it's gonna look so cool. Or I could be a pop star and I could wear this. I feel like this would be a really cute Hannah Montana outfit as well. Okay guys, so that's everything I got in this haul. I hope you guys like this video. Remember to thumbs up and subscribe. And comment down below any other videos you guys want me to film. I'm so sorry if I look very low energy right now. It's 3am. I'm really tired and I really want to go to sleep. I think I might be getting sick right now. Anyways, if you guys like this haul, definitely subscribe. I post two to three times a week. I've been trying to post three times a week, but I've been really tired, so I've been posting two times a week. But yeah, anyways, definitely follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you guys want to see more fashion content from me. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something bad for